So here we have the Toyota Yaris 1.3 VVT Icon on a 14 plate. I'm going to show you around the outside of the car first of all and then we'll hop in and I'll run for a few controls on the inside. As you'll see from the outside it's a five door car with alloy wheels. Let's start off inside the boot and then work our way around the rest of the car from there. So you'll see as we approach the boot area that we've got a 60-40 split folding rear seat and a surprising amount of boot space actually. There's a, there's a lot of space for the size of the car. Okay, so we're just going to work our way back round to the front of the car now before I hop in and run through some controls. But now that I've done a full circle of the car, you can see it's in fantastic condition the whole way around and looks really good in this colour as well. Just before I climb in, I think it's well worth seeing the interior from this exterior point of view. As you can see, the seats are in fantastic condition, as are the carpet areas. There's plenty to run from the dashboard, so let's hop in and we'll do that now. Okay, so we're going to start with the dials. We've got the rev counter on the left, speedometer in the middle, and then the fuel gauge on the far right. You'll see in the middle there, we've got the trip computer, which displays the total miles for this car, which are 7,257. Uh, if we back out to the steering wheel, on the left-hand side, we've got stereo controls, and on the right-hand side, we have cruise control, plus the ability to answer and end phone calls. You'll see also the main controls for the cruise controller just underneath here. Uh, the main stereo unit where we set up the phone is over in the middle here. Uh, so, first of all, there's a few ways of listening to music. If we hit media, uh, we're given the various choices. So at the moment we are on FM radio. We have got AM radio, uh, auxiliary input. It's hard to see because it's greyed out at the moment, but we would select it there should we have plugged something in. Uh, we've got Bluetooth audio, and a USB, and then CD player finally. You can see the CD player at the top of the unit just there. Uh, working our way down, we've got dual zone climate control. So you adjust the temperature independently on the left and right hand sides of the car. The fan speed in the middle just here. And then hit AC to turn the air conditioning on. Or hit auto for it to maintain those two temperatures for you without you having to touch the fan area. Underneath there we've got the 12 volt charging socket. A 6 speed manual gearbox. And then the ability to turn off traction control just down here as well. All that leads me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the car in person and have a test drive, feel free to give any of our MJA sites a call. We look forward to hearing from you soon.